tell you a few things about Gotham City. It has a population of 7.5 million. It boasts the tallest example of neo-Gothic architecture in North America, which you're suspended from, by the way. It has the largest percentage of sociopathic criminals in any metropolitan conurbation, so you're strictly small fry. And it's got me. Oh, no, please! I can't take the hype! You must be from out of town, or you'd know better than to mug tourists at the Founders' Day Parade. No, oh, mister! You can watch it from here till the police arrive. Hope the wire holds good. That was an old Batarang. Batman Nightfall. Police estimate a million Gothamites are lining the streets for the annual Founders Day Parade, Mike. Well, Sherry, the city loves a good time. Only 40 muggings and three deaths reported in the last half hour. We've just been watching the... The Brotherhood is finished, Thomas. I will find you before you find me. But we have found you, Leha. Hide though you might. The vengeance of Azrael is upon you. The hour is come. I am half a world away from you, freak of nature. Even Azrael's sword cannot stretch. Know that men call you liar. Know that men call you betrayer. Know that men call you defiler. Therefore, it is the duty of the angel Azrael to bring you punishment. You will die by the blade of fire. I do not think so, Mr. Angel. You dare threaten Azrael with a firearm as if bullets could harm him. To me, Mr. Angel, it seems as if they have done a great deal of harm. A sword? Armor? This is the 20th century, and you will now die! A fall is as good as a bullet. For after you perishes the Brotherhood. Dr. Jeremiah Arkham. You're Dr. Flanders? Come in. They're eating now. It'll be quiet for a while. You read my manuscript. You'll give me a recommendation. I've read enough to want to show you this part of the institution. I didn't make notes, but when I surrendered my clothes at security, they kept my pen. There's no pockets in these overalls. There are no zippers either. Nothing made of metals allowed in here. We've learned from experience, Dr. Flanders. Privilege I'm about to share with you. Pardon. Welcome to hell, Dr. Flanders. Welcome to Arkham Asylum. I'm coming. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming. What the? <sighs> Who? Father! But you're supposed to be in Europe. These clothes. I am dying, my son. It is your turn. You're bleeding. Gotham University has a doctor. I'll... No doctor. I'll... No one must know of Azrael. Azrael? What's Azrael? I was, like my father before me, as you are now. But I don't understand. Listen. What? Listen. Abandon my body to be found by strangers. What? Then fly home. But there is a package for you there with instructions. <laughs> When you find Nomos, you want to explain everything. I have failed. Nomos? <laughs> but promise me you will not. Reports say 14 people were injured and... Riots are not usually what you concern yourself with, Master Bruce. Four were killed, including Sherry Port. Ah, uh, yes, the television personality. You knew her. Bruce Wayne knew her. Warning, bomb access to Batcave open. And liked her. Batcave secured. Witnesses say that an angel dropping from the sky started the panic. Then in the mess that followed, the angel vanished. Uniform store open. Vanishing angels and sudden death. I retract my earlier statement. It is exactly the sort of thing you concern yourself with. A couple of other items, Alfred. Maybe related, maybe not. Scanner on. Scanner on. One. A cop found this in an alley a block away from the riot site. A Kevlar vest, obviously not as bulletproof as advertised, judging by its condition. Your cowl, sir. Mm. 
two. Carlton Lee Hounds at the penthouse apartment directly above the site of the parade incident. Time for a little detective work. I'm afraid I'm not acquainted with Mr. Lee Hound. You're not alone. He's a money man with no past. He traffics in exotic arms and ammunition, computer-controlled rockets, laser-guided missiles, Teflon-coated bullets. The kind that can penetrate armored vests. That gives us a couple of tentative conclusions. Look at the blood on that vest. Witnesses say the angel survived that fall, staggered off into the crowd. Imagine the willpower it took for him to keep going. What kind of man is he? No one on earth is better qualified than you to answer that question. Car door. Ignition sequencing. Engaging turbofans. You'd better have the Learjet fuel just in case. I dare not ask if I finally to have a holiday, sir. Leha took a Swiss air flight to Lucerne this morning. His arms operation is based in Europe. I intend to make sure he keeps it there. The police department doesn't need an arsenal like that on the streets. No, neither do you. Door closed. Perhaps it would be prudent to pack immediately. I have to find my thermal underwear. You flew back to Europe as your father, Azrael, directed. Only 24 hours ago, you were a graduate student at Gotham University. Now you are a guest in a foreign land with no notion of why you are here. Who are you? I am Nomos, your new teacher. You will learn the system. The system? Why not strike me back? You can, if you are not weak. I wouldn't hit a dwarf. Sorry. My body is crooked. I am older than you can imagine. Your father never told you he was a member of a secret organization dating back to the 14th century. That he killed 11 men and two women in cold blood. That he was a liar and a failure. The Swiss out by helicopter. The noise does rather distract from the view. Our dead knight in Gotham City, the fallen angel, tossed his sword into a dumpster in the alley behind Lee Howe's apartment block. It bore an insignia I asked Oracle to look up for me. She traced it back to this village. And this is the direction in which Leha was seen heading for in a hired chopper earlier today. This is the sigil, the seal of our order, the emblem your father and his ancestors bore upon their weapons as avenging angels, seeking out and destroying those who betrayed the trust of their fellow members. Gaze into the sigil. Unlock the hidden training your father gave you. Know what you already know. I am John Paul Valley, heir to the sword of Azrael. I bend my will to avenge those members of the Order of Saint Dumas betrayed by their fellows. My life is as nothing. I serve in the robe of the avenging angel. That was pretty funny. You think so? Will the swords bite and use you? <laughs> no! <laughs> An accurate kick. How'd I do that? How did I know to do that? Is it possible this Order of St. Dumas still exists? That somehow Leha, the arms dealer, has a beef with them? I think it's very possible, sir. I can see him now directly below us. And he appears to be aiming a rocket launcher. Saint Dumas is finished! I have destroyed the dwarf Nomos and his apprentice! Azrael is no more! I am free! <laughs>